ASML is looking for graduates from all technical fields, from physics to robotics and everything in between. Today I'm meeting with computer engineering graduate Lennart Noordzij here at the ASML campus in Veldhoven. After he obtained his master's degree in computer engineering at the Technical University of Delft, he applied for his first job at ASML. Leonard builds code, but also his future. Let's ask for his thoughts on designing new opportunities. Hey Leonard. Hey Mark. Nice to see you. Uh, shall we go inside? Yes, let's go. Cool. So we met before in Delft and we spoke about your internship. Uh, can you tell us a little bit more about that? During my internship, I was working with GPUs. It's something that I learned in my studies on how to program them. Yeah. And in my internship, I had to investigate how to use them in an ASML context, an ASML problem. Now you decided to stay at ASML after that. Um, what do you like most about working here? Uh, really the multidisciplinary approach. So looking at the problem from different angles. Does it work in software? Does the hardware perform well? Is it also manufacturable? And can we keep it in the machine for a long time? It's very interesting to look at it like this. Shall we go have a seat somewhere? Yeah, let's go. Cool. So, you hear that personal and professional development is experienced on the job here at ASML. How do you experience that? Yeah, uh, I've had a lot of colleagues that I learned a lot from, so ASML is very diverse and I think you can learn most from interacting with a lot of different people. And besides that, I've also been in a coaching program where I could ask questions about things I was struggling with. And also there's budget available for trainings. So really, if I have a problem, I know different ways how to approach it and how I can learn to solve it. Now I hear there's also something like a four o'clock meeting. What is that? A four o'clock meeting is a very interesting meeting within ASML. It's a high pressure meeting where a decision has to be taken. And they start at four o'clock in the afternoon because everybody wants to go home. So you have to take a decision within a certain short time. And that means you really have to prepare very well, make sure all the correct information is available so that everybody will agree on what the correct decision is in the end. Now it sounds like you've developed yourself quite well here in the last two and a half years. Where do you see yourself develop into in the next coming years? Uh, within ASML there's three main tracks that I feel like I can choose from. Uh, you can either go into people management, into project management or into a more technical role. And I noticed that I really like this technical side and the broadness of it, all the different disciplines. So I really want to go more in that direction and try to expand myself there. Great, I can really feel that you are also excited about that. Um, if there are any graduates watching this video now, what advice would you give to them? I see that when I do what I like and I'm interested in it, I do my best work. So really try to figure out what do I want to do, what do I find interesting. And if you show that, it will get recognized and you will be asked to do certain things. So you'll find your place within the company. Thank you so much for your insights, Leonard. If you'd like to learn more about opportunities at ASML, watch our other videos as well.